Hey team, Sensei Brody here. Super excited to be your online instructor. Before we get, wait a second. I feel like I'm forgetting something. You gotta be Hey team, Sensei Brody here. Now that I have my full uniform on, it's super excited to see you guys today. I'll be your online instructor. And before we get started, as a reminder, make sure we have our full uniform on, belt tied nice and tight over our gi and our gi pants. We got room around us to move in. We have a family member or helper around us to help us with some targets or pillows. And once we have all that team, we'll get started. I'll give you five more seconds to make sure. Five, four, three, two, one. All right, team, everyone natural stance. Attention, say sir. Spread your feet, bend your knees, make your fist, cover your fist. How are you guys doing today? Awesome. Feet together, strong bow. Everyone relax. Stance. Student creed, repeat after me. Say to build. True confidence. I must have knowledge in my mind, honesty in my heart, strength in my body. Great job, team every natural stand super strong. So today we're talking about self-discipline. And we say self-discipline. Self-discipline means that I'm doing exactly what I'm supposed to before I'm told. Discipline means I'm doing it as I'm told. Self-discipline means, oh, I do know I know I need to be doing this. So I do it right then and there. And we say, yes, sir. So we're gonna show good discipline in our warm-up. So we start jogging in place. So what's gonna happen is I'm gonna say, go. You're gonna start doing squats. But when I take my two square hand targets and I clap them together like this, you have to go to the next exercise, which we're gonna go from squats, making sure that we're going nice and low and back up to doing some jumping jacks. So squats, jumping jacks. When I clap, you're gonna go to the next one. So start with squats, go. You're squatting low, keeping your hands up. And now I'm not gonna say, all right, team, switch. No, I'm just gonna clap and you should know right away with good discipline, I gotta switch nice and low, team. Make sure we're going all the way down and back up, and good job team. Now we're going to jumping jacks. Keep going over and over again. I'll tell you when to switch by clapping my targets together. So make sure we're listening and having great discipline. <laughs> nice work team. If you're showing good discipline, you're going back to squats now. Keep going really low. And good job. Now we're back to jumping jacks and, and now we're squatting. And keep going, 10 seconds of jumping jacks. 10, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one, time, natural stance. Now, we're gonna go from mountain climbers to bicycles. So let's quick, real, quick, real quick go over that. Can't talk today. You're gonna go into mountain climber position, you're gonna do your mountain climbers. When I clap your targets, you're gonna roll on your back and do your bicycle kicks over and over again. All right, we'll start with mountain climbers, ready? Mount climber position and start going. Running those legs. Run and run and run and run and run. Keep going, making sure we're using our legs, bending our knees. Nice work, team. If you have good discipline, you're rolling over to the other side and using those bicycle kicks now. Keep going. Make sure your hands are up at your head, covering your head so we can use that body rotation, help our core muscles. Good job. Now we're rotating back to mountain climbers. Keep going, team, over and over again. This is showing great discipline, which means I'm ready for that new belt coming up in a few months. That clap, it clap team, so rotate. Now we're at the next drill, keep going over and over again. Nice work, make sure we're going back and forth, quickly rolling, not slowly rolling to the next side, we're going right away. Again team, 10 more seconds, 10 more seconds, 10, nine, eight, seven, six, five, Four, three, two, one, time. Everybody stand up, shake out those legs. All right, so now we're gonna go from knees to push-ups. We're gonna be using our knees a little later. So you're gonna do knee, knee, knee. If I clap, if you go down and do push-ups like a black belt. Now remember, my hands are gonna be straight below me. My eyes are up, I bend my body down, and I push my body back up. I'm not bending my hips. All right, ready? We'll start by doing our knees. Start doing those knees, team. Go, knee, knee, keep going over and over again. Once you hear that clap, that's when we rotate to our push-ups. We don't go slow, we go super quick, right away. That was a loud one, woo! Gotta make sure I turn that down. Awesome, push-ups, team, go! 
Make sure we're getting really low. You don't gotta go super fast. Really low. And now we're back up to our knees. Knee, knee, knee. Keep going. Again, again, and now we're back to push up. See, we wanna see who, who can go the fastest. Stand up, sit back down. Who can go the fastest? Keep going, keep going. Five, four, three, two, one. Nice work. That's another loud one. Woo, these things are good to clap with. I need a whistle or buzzer. And good job, team. Ten more seconds. Ten, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Time. Stand up, team. Everybody relax. Stand. Check out your arms and legs. A lot of moving around for this warm up. Take a deep breath in. Deep breath out. Deep breath in. Deep breath out. Nice job, team. Everybody relax, stance. As a reminder, what's that word we're talking about again today? Self something. Self discipline. Self discipline means that I'm doing exactly what I'm supposed to, even before I'm told to. I can show that at home by making sure that my room is spotless before my family member even comes in. I make sure I clean my stuff up when I'm done with it and make sure it's spotless. But we'll talk about that a little bit more later. So we're gonna work on a side kick today, team. Say side kick. A side kick is one of my favorite kicks, and it's a lot of, it has a lot of power with it, and it has my toes pointing sideways when I kick. Obviously, side kick, side. All right, yeah. Everybody relax, stance. So now, everybody tap on that right. Actually, you know what? Stay here today. We're gonna start in neutral stance today with our hands up high in our fists, and we're gonna be kicking over to the sides first. So, step number one, if you have a fit, hold on one sec. Uh, family members, oh my gosh, she is just so crazy. I can't even keep them under control. It's just, it, it blows me. Oh, sorry, sir. Thank you, family members. Awesome. Speaking of family members, if you have a family member, can you please call them over to help you out? Target Pillow, it's going to help out with this next drill. It's going to help us practice. So, uh, well, first we'll go into the next dance. All righty, team. So, first we're going to do this in the air. You're going to take your right leg, you're going to lift it up in the air and do that knee, and then we're going to put it back down. So our family member is going to stand in front of us later, and we're going to touch our knee to the target. Not knee the target, touch our knee to the target and then put it back down, all right? Ready, one more time. Touch the target, or touch the air for now. Put it back down. Say chamber. Touch the air, chamber. Too many words today. Chamber, and down. One more time. Chamber, and down. Trying to stay balanced and not flop around. I'm going slow, control of my chamber. All right, take that other leg now, your left leg. Lift it up, say chamber, put it back down. Chamber, put it back down. Two more times. Chamber, down. I'm taking a big step, chamber and down. Wonderful. All right, so now what we're gonna do is put that kick together with two parts. So, we're gonna chamber our right leg up in the air, and now we're gonna imagine that there's, a, there's just a wall in front of us. We're gonna lightly touch the wall, touch the wall. And I'm just gonna put it back down, just put it back down. Now we're not kicking walls today, team. Say, I'm not gonna kick a wall. All right, good, you told me, you can't kick walls now. All right, lift your leg up. Just gently imagine you're touching a wall. Put it down. Good, one more time. Remember, we're not falling though. Chamber, push, kick back down. Our toes are sideways. Let's try our other leg down. Lift it up into a chamber like you're touching your knee onto something. Push your leg out, push. Put it back down, controlling my leg. Make sure it's sideways. Chamber, I'm gonna kinda lean back a little bit too. Push, put it back down. One more time. Chamber, push, and back down. I gotta work on my right leg kicks. All right, so now what we're gonna do is have a family member or helper come on out with us. So get a family member or helper, and they're gonna stand right in front of you. Five, four, three, two, one. All right, so family member or helpers, you're gonna take the target pillow, whatever's there, and hold it in front of them, a little bit away from their stomach, about the waist level. They're gonna bring their knee up and gently touch the target. Then they have to push and kick their leg out into the air slowly. So they have to bring their hands up, touch the target, push, and put it back down. That's all. Touch and push. When they're done doing it three times, they're going to do, we're going to do one of our exercises we did in the warm-up, and we're going to start with our mountain climbers. They're going to do seven mountain climbers. Oh, we'll do eight mountain climbers because it's an even number. Eight mountain climbers and reset and do it again. Ready? Touch the target or touch the pillow. Push your leg out three times. Eight mountain climbers. Too much numbers today. All right. Go ahead, team. Get started. 
Touch the target. Push your leg out. Woo. Touch the target. Push your leg out. Touch the target. Push your leg out. Awesome. Now we're going to our eight mountain climbers team. Woo. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Nice work. Member team, make sure we have that good discipline doing exactly what we're supposed to. Family members, try not to tell them what to do. Try to have them remember what it is because they have good discipline and they know exactly what we're doing in class. Lift the leg up, push it out, and down. Lift the leg up, push it out, and down. Lift the leg up, push it out, and down. Nice. Keep going, team. We still got some time. Make sure we're working on that good form today. Let's do this way. One. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Ooh. All right, keep it up, team, nice and strong. Chamber, kick, Ooh. put it back down. Chamber, push, push, and back down. Chamber, push, and down. About 30 more seconds, team, 30 seconds. Seven, eight. Nice job, team. A few more seconds. Keep going. We got a few last rounds to do. Ooh. He's falling off today. Chamber, push, down. Ooh. Chamber, push, down. Chamber, push, down. Everybody, time. Relax, stance. What's that? What we're talking about again today? Self. Self-discipline, and for self-discipline, we're gonna be going over our next part so we know how our chamber is supposed to look. So now we're gonna have our family members hold the target for us to kick, but we have to go over the kick first. All right, we're gonna chamber our leg up with our right leg, chamber it in the air. And now my family member is eventually later is gonna stay on our side over here because we have to push the target now and then put our foot down. So we're gonna lift our leg up, hitting that imaginary target or pillow, and then shoot it out and hit the target. It's gonna be on this side now. So chamber your leg up, say chamber, push it out, say asa, and then put it back down. Ready? Chamber up, say chamber, push it out, asa, and let it back down. One more time. Lift it up, chamber, push out, asa, and back down. Nice, all right, let's try our other leg now. Lift it up in that chamber, imagine that we're touching the target, push it out, say, Asa, and put it down. Remember, I'm hitting with my toes pointing sideways. Chamber it up and push it out. Asa, and back down. One more time. Lift it up. Chamber, push out. Asa, and back down. All righty, so now we're going to get back with our family members and we're going to do the exact same thing. This time, our family member is going to hold the target or pillow flat so we can actually hit it, hitting right for the shark, or right for the center of the pillow, and we're going to chamber the air now. So we're not touching our leg to anything. We have to have good self-discipline and know, oh, I know I have to chamber before I kick out. Three side, oh, we'll do four side kicks now. We can make it up a number. Four side kicks. Then at the end, we're gonna do six squats. Four side kicks, six squats. Go ahead, team, get started right away. All right, I'm in my chamber, push out, asa, back down. Chamber, asa, and back down. Chamber, asa, and back down. One more time. Chamber, asa, and back down. And now I do my six squats. Remember, team, I have good self discipline. I know my hands are up the whole time I'm in my guarding stance. And when I'm doing my squats, I'm not dropping them one bit. Back on over. Ready? Chamber up. Asa. Really strike hard, team. But make sure I'm staying on my feet and staying still. Chamber. Asa. Chamber. Asa. Woo. It's falling there. One more time. Chamber. Asa. Woo. Six squats, team. We got time. Keep going. Make sure you're really working on that chamber and pushing out with our eyes on the target. Woo. Be an eye. Two. Three. Four. Five. Six. Back on that. Back to my side kicks. Woo. Chamber. Asa. Chamber. Asa. Chamber. Asa. Three. Chamber. 
Awesome. Four. Keep on going, team. About a minute left. One minute left. One, two, three, four, five, six. Nice job. All right, keep going, team. Ready? Chamber. Awesome. Chamber. Awesome. Chamber. Awesome. One more time. Chamber. Awesome. All right. We got time for about maybe a few more squats and a few more kicks. Keep going. Go. Keep falling off. One and two and three, four, five, six. Fifteen seconds, everyone. Fifteen seconds. Chamber. Awesome. One. Asa, two, chamber, asa, three, chamber, asa, four. Everyone time, relax stance. So now team, I'm gonna pass it off to my instructor. They're really good at this next part, so I'm gonna oh, pass it off to you. No, you are good, sir, you're great at it. You keep going, all you. So nice, come on. Alrighty, so now what we're gonna do is we're gonna work on doing that side kick and we're gonna re-chamber because we're forgetting the re-chamber. So we have to remember, when I kick out, I gotta bring my foot back into that chamber and put it down. So our family members are gonna hold the target and they're gonna hold it back up to where we first chambered. So we have to touch the target, kick out, and touch the target again before we put it down. Well first, let's go over how that's gonna look. Good, turn back on the wall. Hands up. You're gonna bring your right leg up into a chamber, push it out, and bring it right back, and then I put it down. Hands up on my face. Lift it up, chamber, push it out, bring it back, and put it down. One more time. Lift it up, push it out, bring it back, put it down. Let's try our other leg this time, ready? Lift it up, push it out, bring it back, and put it down. I gotta touch target two times, on the chamber, and then on the re-chamber, all right? Ready, lift it up, chamber, push it out, bring it back, and put it down. One more time, chamber, push it out, bring it back, and put it down. Everybody relax, stance. So family members, during this drill, if they need help with some of the balance, don't be afraid to hold your arm out, because you have the target here and your arm here, and they can hold on to it a little bit for balance, not just you know use the whole support. So you're gonna hold the target flat out. They have to bring their chamber in, push out, bring it back, and then put it down so they work on that re-chamber. You're gonna do three side kicks over with your family members. Then you're gonna do what have we done yet? 10 jumping jacks. And get right back in line and say, yes, sir. All right, let's do it with our family members. Three side kicks working on those chambers and those re-chambers with good discipline. And then heading over to doing 10 jumping jacks. Get started, team. Go. We got a minute and a half to do this one. Chamber. Asa. Put it back down. Chamber. Asa. Re-chamber. And down. Chamber. Asa. Re-chamber. And down. Woo. 10 jumping jacks. Make sure I'm not on any slope. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Woo. All right. Other side now. Remember, team, both sides. Practice both sides. Chamber. Asa, re chamber. And down. Chamber. Asa, re chamber. And down. Chamber. Asa, re chamber. And down. Hey, all right, jump guys. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, and a nine, and a ten. Hey, back on the wall. All right, team, about 45 seconds left. 45 seconds. Chamber, asa, re chamber, and down. Chamber, asa, re chamber, and down. Chamber, asa, re chamber. And down. All right, back to our jumping jacks. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, and nine. That's it. Good job, team. About 15 more seconds. 15 seconds. Chamber, asa. Back down. Chamber, asa. Back down. Chamber, asa. Back down. And everybody, time. Relax stance team. Give your family member a high five, big hug. Say thanks for helping me out. They use a lot, a lot, a lot of help today with you guys. Alrighty, and once we're done every natural stance, and lock it up. Alright team, make sure we're sitting crisscross, hands on knees, back straight, eyes focused up in the front. 
So we're talking about self-discipline today. Self-discipline we practice here at Action by taking our, or taking our chambers and putting it back into a re-chamber, putting it away right away. So like I said before, at home, what can we be putting away before our family members ask? Yeah, right. We have our toys we can put away, our shoes, our jackets, our backpacks, putting away right before, you know, before we're even told to when we're done with it. What about at school? What's a few things we can put away at school? Yeah, exactly. If we're like working with some supplies, we put the supplies away. We don't just leave them out. Our chairs, push them in. If we have anything else around, we can always put that away. But we want to make sure we're having good self-discipline and doing it before we're asked, right away, right then and there. Everybody say, yes, sir. All right, stand up. All right, team. So the last part of our kata, the last part of our class, which I said is our favorite, my favorite part of the class, which is our kata. We're going to do ninja power, super strong, with great discipline, knowing our chambers should be right by our side, our stances should be really low, and my moves should be strong. Action kata, ninja power, bow, horse stance, up, in, out, touch, down. Back, asa, aya. Remember, my discipline means I have my hands up, not dropping them. Jab, cross, front kick, feet together, bow, team, ninja sharks, rock. Oh, yeah. Nice work, everybody. Natural stance, super strong team. So, our homework today is to do those side kicks five times on each side with a good chamber, re-chamber, and a solid kick, obviously. When you still have your homework, don't forget to send it to your head instructor or enrollment director. Otherwise, that's all we have, team. Natural stance. Attention, say, sir. Everybody relax, stance. You have fun today, team. Awesome, repeat that to me nice and strong. Say, we are a black belt school. We're dedicated, we're motivated, we're on a quest. Be our best. Bring your hands and feet together. Big, strong bow. Hand back, say action. Shake your hands. Start clapping, team. And say yes, 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 yes,